Hey guys, Justin here coming at you from the 2x4 test tent with another unboxing video. This one is from Chilled, and you know it is a great day when a box shows up from Chilled. I am excited, I'm sure you're excited, so let's just get into it. Alright, there we go. And look at that, it is a Chilled X6 Mini. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. So this is one of their brand new lights that they just came out with. Uh, I love the, uh, the X1 Minis that I have. Amazing. And the X3 Mini. So this being an X6 Mini, it's going to be perfect for a 2x4 space. This is going to kill the game. I'm excited. Uh, I did request the Veg Spectrum one, so we're going to test the Veg Spectrum. They should be about the same uh, power as far as Veg to Flower but uh, the spectrum will just be slightly different. But I'm gonna be using this as a veg light, so I wanted the veg spectrum. And uh, make sure you uh, thumbs up and like this content if you really enjoy it, and uh, click the links below to support the channel. Uh, looks like we've got the uh, accessory box and the light. Let's go ahead and take a look uh, closer at both of those. All right, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at the accessory box first and see what, uh, what comes inside here. Of course, we've got baby katana to help us out opening this up this man this tape is good <laughs> that's some strong tape hear that or I got a sharpen baby katana again it's amazing how uh, tape will dull the knife like just crazy it's really quick all right nice packing everything's secure Let's see what kind of paperwork we got here We got a thank you for your purchase. All their particulars there to contact them, check them out. If you need some help there. And let's see. A big fat accessory pack here. We got a dimmer with the quick disconnect. Super easy to hook up. We've got two sets of rope ratchets, metal gear on the rope ratchets, of course. Wouldn't expect anything less from a light of this quality. We've got a power cord, standard 120. You can order this in uh, 120, uh, 240, uh, even uh, a couple of European standards. You can uh, order direct from them and they'll ship it to you with that plug. Then that's a quick disconnect waterproof connector there. So pretty cool, you can actually order it from, from anywhere. And then we've got, imagine this is from the driver to the light, pretty long cord. There again, quick disconnect, waterproof. Awesome. I imagine this is gonna be the driver. And everything's just packed in here so nicely. Make sure nothing gets ruined. So here's the driver. Bam! Look at that. Still using the Meanwell drivers. One of the few companies out there that hasn't skimped and gone with a slightly cheaper brand. Although still good. Um, Meanwell is just like the uh, the Cadillac, the, the Porsche, the Lamborghini. Uh, whatever, you, whatever you want to call it, whatever your favorite brand of vehicle is, that's what this is. So this is uh, what it's going to come with. And it's got the quick disconnects on there to hook everything up. Like this is super easy to hook up. Uh, this is the commercial model, so it comes pre-built, completely pre-built. Take a look at the light here real quick. So that does come in completely pre-built. You can get, uh, I believe, a DIY version of this and save a little bit of money. But you don't, uh, I don't believe you get the full warranty, but they did just change their warranty recently on the DIY stuff. So definitely uh, email them if you have any questions on warranty and stuff. Uh, they're, they're really, really easy to get a hold of and really easy to talk to. So uh, I have no, uh, no issues about sending anybody to them as far as the uh, warranty stuff goes. But uh, yeah, let's, uh, let's take a little closer look at the, uh, at the light here. All right, so you can see we've got 
six bars going across. So ultimate coverage, excellent spacing. These are Samsung uh, diodes, 3000 and 5000K, I believe, mixed in. And then there is gonna be red, uh, still on this one, you can see there is red there. And then the two ones that look white, those are gonna be blue. Like I said, this is the Veg Spectrum that I ordered from them because I will be using it as a Veg Light, but you could easily use this Veg Light as a, uh, a full-on flower light in a two x four, honestly. Like this is, this is more like three x five Veg, uh, maybe even bigger than that, honestly. Like this, is, this thing's gonna blast. You're gonna see, it's gonna light this tent up like a Christmas tree. It's gonna be awesome. <laughs> But yeah, I can't wait to see the uh, spectrum and see the blue come out. But there is still some red in there. I'm kind of surprised that there is still one red diode. Maybe it's infrared. I don't know. Let's see. I don't think they have infrared, though. But yeah, just a slick looking light. Built really well. Like solid, solid. Ridiculous solid. And then, of course, you can change out your uh, plates here. You can get different plates from Chilled if you want to change out the colors. They have several different colors available. Really, really cool. Mix and match. But yeah, let's get this sucker hooked up and uh, see what kind of power she pushes. All right, guys, we are back and we've got it all hooked up. Super easy. Just the uh, four rope ratchets and uh, you're good to go. Like this thing is, uh, is definitely plug and play, to say the least. Take a look at these beautiful bars with the blue and a little bit of red. That is killing the game, guys. Wow. Killing the game. Awesome, awesome. <laughs> I just love, uh, I love chilled bars, man. It's like one of my favorite products on the market right now. Definitely, just awesome. Let's uh, let's kick the uh, par meter on here. You can see we're at the uh, the bare minimum on the dimmer here, and we are at uh, 17 inches off the canopy as usual, or off the floor, I should say, uh, to simulate a 16-inch canopy because the sensors are about about an inch tall over there. So, killer, killer. Let's. Uh, Let's crank this sucker up and uh, see what she can do. We're at uh, 30 watts on the base here. We're not quite to the point where we can get to uh, seedlings. So let's hit seedlings first. Wow, we're there quick. All right, so 50 watts. 50 watts and we're, uh, we're in seedling territory. Seedlings and clones. Let's take a quick center reading there. 162, 130-ish around the sides, around the corners. That's great. Be able to uh, clone and uh, and have seedlings throughout this entire floor and not have any issues. That's nice. Let's uh, crank it up and find veg now. Almost there. Oh, 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 went a little too fast. Man, this thing really pushes. This thing really pushes. All right, so we're going to call it like right about there. That's right. I don't know if you can see that on the dimmer there. Not quite in the middle of this top portion. And that's going to be our uh, veg territory. So about 350. Is where I like to veg. Some people will veg with uh, with less, and some people will veg with more. That's just kind of what I've found over my uh, many years of growing. My kind of sweet spot for uh, for vegging plants is about right there. So that's where I'd be. We're at 137 watts to veg an entire two x four. That is uh, that's awesome, man. That's going to save you on your power bill uh, just <laughs> just right out the gate, right out the gate. Get a quick uh, center reading before we move on here. 
444 in the middle. So not definitely not into flower territory, but uh, that's at the uh, the top end of what I would say you'd want to veg with. Uh, they start to get a little bit uh, yellowed out sometimes if you get into the flower uh, uh, flower uh, PPFD in veg. So I tend to uh, keep it a little lower. Plus, I mean, you can save some electricity by keeping it lower as well. But let's uh, let's find uh, let's find where flower is going to be here. We're going to probably get there pretty quick. All right, so the base of flower, say about 600, is where we'll start. I got 600, 615, 620, somewhere in there. So that's where we're at on the dimmer. Pretty much almost pointing right directly at that corner. Uh, 254 watts, about 600 PPFD across all four corners. Let's take a uh, center reading. 775. So yeah, this is perfect, man. For a beginner, this is where I would start. If you're just starting out and you're wanting good results and you don't, you're not really maybe not that good at uh, pH or you're not that good at measuring nutrients or just any any sort of issue that you're in, unsure of. Uh, using this uh, base level, I would call it, uh, PAR is going to help you out as far as being able to take care of the plants by pushing them just a little bit less, but pushing them enough to still produce a really, really nice crop. So that's uh, that's where I would be for like a beginner grow is the six to 800 range. That's, that's going to give you some really, really nice nuggets for sure. But now... Let's crank it up for the uh, the rest of us here that know what we're doing. We're cranked up all the way as far as we can go. And bam, look at that. We're 800 in the corners. Now that is pushing some par. 800 in the corners. Killing the game, guys. Killing the game. Center reading. 1,000? 1,020. 1,024. 23, 22. Man, that is awesome. So we're about a 200 spread from the corner to the center, which is great, thanks to the uh, the even spread on the bars, killing the game. And then we've got a thousand in the middle and 800 in the corners. This is a killer two by four light. If you guys are looking for something for your two by four tent, this is off the chain. This is gonna kill the game 100 percent 100 percent let's take a quick side reading back there 917 let's go over here 800 so yeah we're 800 everywhere minimum minimum 800 everywhere just absolutely crushing it chill did it again man they did it again with a badass light man awesome awesome so let's uh let me get the uh, spectrometer out here if you guys want to click the uh, links below to check out the light feel free there's a lot of great info there on the uh, light itself plus the price and everything it's around 700 bucks uh, right now on sale uh, you can get an even bigger discount with my uh, discount code so make sure to uh, enter the discount code that's all below in the description take a look at that let's kick on the uh, spectrometer here there we go all zeroed out and bam look at that blue <laughs> yeah blue this is a veg light folks that's what i ordered i mean you can order this in flower so don't don't let this freak you out uh, i specifically ordered this in veg and we're looking at about an even blue to red it's still got quite a bit of red because i mean it does have the uh red diode here and there and then uh cool or uh excuse me warm white along with the cool white a little bit of far red really nice man really nice it still has the little 
You see the little uh, 660 bump of red there. And then a big blue spike. Hell yeah. That's awesome. Killing the game. I dig it. I can't wait to put this up in the veg tent. This is going to go in my uh, my two and a half by four and a half uh, veg tent. And it's going to be absolutely perfect. Awesome. So let's, uh, all we got left to do really is let this sucker warm up. And uh, we'll take some heat readings and, uh, and we'll wrap it up. All right, we're back and we've let this warm up for quite some time. It's plenty warm now, so let's uh, go ahead and take a look at the thermal imaging camera here. I mean, that's pretty even. Definitely pretty even. It's going to be hotter in the middle, of course. Hot spot 115. That's really good. 115 there. And then the driver. Ooh, the driver's pretty warm. 155. So the driver's pushing pretty hard. That is for sure. 155. I would definitely run that outside the tent. As you can see, that's what I'm doing here. I usually put mine on top of the tent. But yeah, that's... Uh, that's pretty damn good. The bars are always nice and cool on these uh, chilled. Great name. <laughs> They're always nice and cool on the chilled products. Like, yeah, that's awesome. And then these sidebars, the, the heat's almost non-existent. Like none. And then just kind of warm on these. That's, that's so nice. This is a really, really nice setup here. If you guys are looking for a 2x4 light... Or even a 3x5 light. This is a killer, killer setup. Make sure you use the uh, discount codes below. Save on this one here. Really, really awesome. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this one. I am going to enjoy the hell out of it as I use it. Because I'm definitely keeping this one. So, until next time guys. Happy growing.